So today, I'm going to be doing a Q&A for you guys. I asked you guys to ask me a couple of questions on Instagram or Facebook or the comment section down below. So I'm going to read some of the questions that you guys asked me and answer them, to, answer them to the best of my abilities, okay? So bear with me, okay, guys? Okay, first question of the day. One of you guys asked me, how long have you been doing YouTube? Well, guys, I've been doing YouTube for about eight to nine months, going on ten the most. Um, and how do I like it? Can I give you guys my review on the experience? Um, I'm grateful. I like it. Um, I feel that if you don't enjoy what you do, um, it won't be a good experience for you. But overall, I'm beyond blessed to be able to um, do YouTube for you guys and bring you guys great content. Um, am I perfect at it? No. Do I love it? Yes. Okay, second question. Um, are you married? No, I'm not married. For those of you guys, I'm not married. Um, do I see myself getting married? Maybe in the future, who knows? But um, at the moment, I'm content with being by myself. Um, I go to church, so I put God first. So I believe that, you know, in the right timing, God will bring me the right person. Okay, number three. Um, where do you see yourself in five years? I see myself in five years, hopefully building a better platform with you guys, hopefully being more stable. Um, I can't tell you if I'll be in Bakersfield or if I'll be somewhere new. It's wherever God wants to place me. If he wants to place me here, fine. If he wants to move me out of state, that's even better. I'm not going to fight with it, guys. Okay, um, the next question. What is your favorite food? Well, there's a couple of favorite foods that I have. One being pizza. Number two, I would have to say chicken alfredo. Um, number three, I would have to put tacos, guys. Tacos would probably be my third. And for the fourth, I would say probably spaghetti. Okay, guys. Um, the next question. Is your grandma always a character on and off camera? Yes, guys. For those of you guys who ask, my grandma is a character off and on camera. She loves being on camera. She loves to joke around with you guys. She's all, all around amazing. Okay? The next question. Is your uncle and your grandma going to be more in your videos from time to time? Yes, you guys will see them from time to time. And there will be more in my videos as you guys go on. Um, me and my uncle are kind of similar. We kind of bump heads a lot. So when we, when we joke around on camera or when we kind of bump heads a little bit, it's, it's not in a bad way. It's kind of in a funny way. So yeah, there'll be more in my videos, you know, um, they love to do YouTube. They love to be in videos. They love doing, you know, content for you guys. The more nice comments down below, you guys will see them. Okay, the next question. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is red. For those of you guys who don't know, red is my favorite color. That was also my grandpa's favorite color. So I think that's the reason why. But I like red if you guys couldn't already tell. Next question. Did you play any sports in high school or in general? I actually played baseball for four years, guys. I played baseball for um, a small league called Fairfax Little League. I don't know if any of you guys know, if you guys are from Bakersfield, you guys are familiar with it. If not, then yeah, there's this little school here called, it's an elementary school called Fairfax Elementary. They have the Fairfax League where we play baseball, t-ball, and up. So yeah, I played for four years, guys. Okay, next question. How many siblings do you have? Okay, I actually have four siblings, guys, including myself. So three. But um, I have my older sister, which is Stacy. I have my brother, Jesus, which is the middle child. And then it's, it's my twin, Rafael. And then it's me, guys. I'm actually identical twin, but my twin passed away, guys. If you guys didn't know, he passed away um, when we were born, of course. We were born premature, so he passed away. But um, I actually have three siblings, guys. My older sister, my middle brother, and then it's my twin and then me. Okay, the next question.
do you feel that you're an impact to people all around the world or a good influencer? Um, that's a good question. I love to give advice if necessary or if I can relate to the situation, then yeah. Um, I would love to be a greater influencer. I would love to be able to help a lot of people around the world. But with that being said, um, yeah, I do feel like I make an impact on people's life and I feel like I do um, try to bring as much happiness as I possibly can to you guys. To the viewers at home, I appreciate you guys and I love you guys. Um, you know, but yeah, with that being said, thank you for tuning in. I hope that I can make you guys laugh. I hope that I can be there for the good and the bad times, whatever it is. I'm always looking forward to bringing a smile to your face. Okay, next question. If you can go anywhere in the world, where would it be? Like on a vacation or to live or anything like that? I would have to say Barcelona would be one of the main places I would love to go visit and sightsee. I don't know why. Something about Barcelona is like the most ideal romantic place for me. I feel like that would be like a romantic getaway, something that would be amazing to experience, the language barrier, the food, the sightseeing, all of that. I feel like it would be a lot to take in, but I feel like it would be romantic or amazing to experience. Okay, next question. What is your least favorite thing to do? I'm going to have to say with this one, guys, my my least favorite thing to do would have to be going swimming. Why? Because I don't like to really get wet. I like, I mean, I don't mind going swimming, but I have to be in the mood for it. I don't really like to get wet. I don't like to be hot. I'm kind of like bipolar when it comes to the weather. I don't really like to be hot. I don't like to be cold. I don't like to be wet. I don't know. I'm kind of like one of those people that just can't make up their minds. But um, yeah, that would have to be that. Okay, next question. If you can take your mom and dad on an ideal vacation, what would be the vacation? And what do you think would be the highlight of the vacation? I would have to say, if I could take my mom and dad on an ideal vacation, it would be like one of those, um, what is it, boat cruises? But... I feel that it would have to have like slot machines or something like that just because my mom and dad enjoy that. That's their peace of mind. That's their, um, how do you say their, their zen, you know, like whenever you have to find your zen, that's their zen. It helps relax them, helps calm them. But I would say just the ideal vacation would be like a boat cruise, one of those carnival boat cruises. I hear those are a lot of fun, and I hear that they're amazing. They have a lot of good food, a lot of good entertainment. So I would say that. Next question. What would be your ideal dream car? My ideal dream car, guys? Well, I had an Escalade, but I got into a car accident, so I don't have that Escalade anymore. But I would have to say my ideal dream car, I love the Escalade, don't get me wrong. I would have to say it would be a Hummer. Why? I think I have little people syndrome where they want big cars or big stuff. I wouldn't say like a gigantic house or anything like that. But like little people syndrome, they want big cars and, you know, stuff that's bigger than them, you know. And they don't want to feel low to the ground or anything like that, you know. So I would have to say a Hummer, guys. That would be the one on my list. Okay, next question. Can you see yourself doing modeling or anything like that in the future? Um, that's a good question. Um, I can see myself doing modeling or Fashion Nova or um, maybe, you know, commercials or, you know, advertisements like that, stuff like that. I can definitely do. Um, I would like that in the future. But, um, yeah, I could definitely see myself doing that. Okay, next question. Are we going to see more of your family on your vlogs? And if so, when? Okay, guys, that's a good question. You will definitely see more of my family on my vlogs, but I cannot give you a time frame. Why? Because my family is a very busy family. We all work. We all strive to um, get ahead in life. So we're all on different time frames, obviously, you know, 
Everybody has their own families. Everybody, you know, has their own, you know, situations that they're going through. Um, you know, so it's kind of hard to get us all in one place at one time. But I'm more than sure that when you we do, you know, it's going to be amazing. And it's going to be funny for you guys. As you guys already saw by the birthday party, my nephew's birthday party. That's my great nephew at that. But my great nephew's birthday party was amazing. Most of our family showed up. We're still missing a lot more. But when we get together, it's overall a great time and fun, you know. Um, you know, most families, when they get together, you know, it's not always about partying or anything like that. It's sometimes just about being together and spending time together. And that's one thing my family loves to do. We love to give quality time and we love to give back. And we love to see people smiling and, you know, bring joy to their, you know, fa their faces or make them smile or anything like that. You know, we love that, you know. Okay, next question. Have you ever paid it forward? And if so, can you give us an example? I have paid it forward, guys. Um, Just a while back, probably like maybe a week ago, I would say. We went to the grocery store, me and my nephew. We were standing in line, and there was this lady that was in front of me. She um actually was only going to buy coffee and creamer. And um, she didn't have enough. She was sliding her card and was declining. So I noticed that and I offered to pay for it, not because I wanted anything from her or I wanted anything in return, but I went ahead and offered to pay for it and she was completely grateful. So yeah, well guys, that's gonna go ahead and end this video. Those are the questions that you guys asked me. Go ahead and comment down below what you guys liked about it and if you guys wanna know more, go ahead and feel free to ask me anything. Um, well, if you're new here, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be back with more videos. I'm Reva, I love you guys, and I thank you guys, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.